today's video. I haven't um, done one of these videos in a while. <laughs> the last video I kind of did that was like this was the apple crumble one. So I've done two baking videos um, before, so this is the third one. Comment down below if you want, if you want me to make this a series or, you know, shall I continue with this type of thing. Anyway. Oh wait. Wait. Hold on. Wait one millisecond. bring you up close so you can actually see it. Hold on. Mm-hmm. That's off. A little bit of preparation. Okay, so today we are going to be making salted caramel brownies and I'm so, so excited because I've never actually properly made brownies or really like tried them before. So I'm really excited to do it and it's perfect because I really want to start baking early this October and bake those treats and ready for autumn and Halloween because Halloween is coming so close. <gasps> okay. <gasps> okay. Whew. Um, the first thing we need to do, all the ingredients that we need is one medium egg and then we need um, 33 millilitres of oil or 42 grams of melted salted butter. So... Since I don't have butter still, I'm just going to use margarine. <laughs> Lovely. Well, um, something happened and I was sitting down on the floor because that's what I do normally in my day and day, day and day. And then I heard some rolling coming from above. Uh, I saw some rolling. I dropped an egg. Okay, so as you saw, the egg kind of on the floor, but do you think that's gonna stop me? No. Oh. Okay. 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 Pretty simple steps. Don't be focused either. But it's all right to know, Biggie. All right. So, so we have. Okay. So one medium egg, and we stir egg, water, and oil, and brown it. But I'm gonna substitute the oil for margarine. Okay. So no, no, actually, I don't want you to see my face. Not that you want to see my face, but hello! I don't know why I can't do a single video without some little rat coming in the room. I even put a sign on the door. Why is no one obeying? So first I've got to put egg in a medium sized bowl. Water, okay. Um, four tablespoons and one teaspoon of Water. <coughs> okay, so that's four. And then you're going to require one of the teaspoons. Yeah, four tablespoons and one teaspoon. And lovely jubbly. And then salted butter. <coughs> How much of that? Now we're going to need something fancy. Um, last time, I just used one of these bad boys to measure my butter. Instead of that, we've upgraded with... Mm -hmm. Now, so we've got this scale here to measure our butter. Okay, let's open this brand new. And this is the caramel sauce thing. So we do bowl while by doing this. Oh, okay, got it. Uh, so let's add this in. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, get in now. This is how it's looking. It's looking very cute. So that's all the brownie mix in the bowl. Okay, so now we're going to stir it all up with my massive spoon. Add all that stuff and in a medium bowl until well blended. So excited! 
it's looking really, it's looking good. It's looking really good. I don't know how it's meant to look, but it's looking good. Oh wait, you meant to melt the butter crap. I made a boo-boo. Yeah, I was meant to um basically um melt the butter, but now it's looking like a little shit. Like it actually looks like a lump of poo. It looks nice though. <laughs> starting to get a bit wooey. This is what it looks like. Look at it. Yeah. All right. <laughs> so I'm gonna put this in a <clears throat> separate bowl. Ugh, no, no. And what we've got to do now is just get some salty salt. Himalayan exotic, um, two pinches. So, now we're gonna put this in the microwave for how long? 30 seconds, not long. Bubble cream, bubble disgusting. Oh, it's done. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Oh my gosh, oh my god, it's very, very bubbly. Um, pour half the batter into a prepared tin, cover with the rest of the brownie batter. Sounds pretty good to me. Baking paper. All right, so I've got this paper, and now we're going to... Um, pour half of the butter into a prepared. Okay, so half the butter. How am I to? I'm not good at fractions. Why is there like nothing to work with? Why is there like nothing in the pan? Like it's a stupid amount of butter. What to do?
out. We did it for 20 minutes and it's meant to be for like 22, 25 minutes. So we just try to see if it's ready. They're ready. So these are them done. I've let them cool and it smells so good. So this is how they look. This is how they look. I had to, that's the fork because I had to test if it was, if it was baked all the way. Why would you do that? You want to scrap? Let's have it. <laughs> no. Presentation matters. Professionalism. Oh, they turned out, it looks amazing. Ah, okay, I think it's time to try that. Okay, so I got my little piece. I took one of the corner pieces because I heard those ones are the best. I'm gonna try it, I hope it's good. That's what it looks like. Mm. Mm. These are great. Oh my god, what a petite. I'm going to eat these while we watch our um, movie that we're going to watch tonight. Oh, I'm so glad I made this. So I'm just going to serve this up to the rest of my um, family. And I'm going to get their reviews and see if they like it. Okay, so that is it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. Make sure to like, subscribe and hit the bell notification button to be notified whenever I post a new video. And comment down below if you want me to make more um, baking videos and kind of make it kind of like a series or something. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video. Love you all. Bye. Okay. Leng. Oh, is it?